time, but you guys are still pointing your knee towards his head right here. I'm stepping my knee all the way in front, blocking this elbow, and I'm, I'm trying to get my knee deep in there. I want to point it towards his body right there. And that way when I flare my elbow, it helps me with my rotation, okay? So that's really important for when we go this next stuff. All right, so I'm teaching this in a certain order. So now, the guy scouted me. He's seen me wrestle before. He's, I'm still able to get the cross wrist, but I can't dig my hand in here. He's just pinching off in there. So now I am going to go to the elbow. So just like our breakdown, I'm going to reach my hand in here, grab a handful of bicep, right? But just like I said earlier, this is too loose. I can't go this way now. So I'm going to go the other way, okay? I'm going to do the exact same thing, just on the other side of his body. I'm going to go to my wrist side now, I'm going to put my knee in front of the wrist, point it towards his body. Again, I'm doing my deep squat, shoelace to shoelace. The only difference is now I really have to get shoulder to shoulder and crush this post right here. As I crush that post, I'm pulling this elbow to my chest, and then as I fall, as soon as he's loaded up, I really have to kick my foot that shoelace to shoelace to the ceiling, and my knee that's in the crotch has to point to the ceiling as well as I really pull this elbow to my chest here. Okay, and again, as I go shoelace to shoelace, or after I get my tilt, I go from shoelace to shoelace to above the knee, right? Because I want to control that hip. If I stay up here and this knee drops, he's just going to belly out. So I really have to make sure I'm above the knee and my knee is pointing to the ceiling, okay? So I got my cross wrist, can't dig my hand, hand full bicep. Come around to this other side. Knee right here in the crotch, shoelace to shoelace. Really crushing that arm as I pull that elbow. See how he's kind of falling? I'm not leaning back and trying to pull him on top. I want my chest, think like a gut wrench. I want my chest right here on his back, just digging this shoulder into his shoulder blade. Right there. As soon as he goes to the elbow, I know I have it. Now I start pulling this elbow to my chest, fall on my hip, keep pulling, readjust my load up. Okay? Get my near fall, let him belly out. Alright, so we're on the opposite side this time. Ready? One, two.